Water flows faster on the outside bend of a meander because it has further to travel. Its speed and erosive capacity is therefore greater. This erodes the outside of the meander, producing a river cliff and a deeper channel on that side. On the inside bend, the water is shallower and slower, allowing the river to deposit some of its load. The deposits form what's known as a slip-off slope. Water also flows in a horizontal corkscrew motion, called helicoidal flow in certain sections of a meandering river. This transports more eroded material from the river cliff of one meander to the slip-off slope of the next. This process makes the meanders bigger and assists in their slow migration downstream. But why do rivers meander? One theory is that they're created when the main current in a river swings from side to side to avoid riffles. Riffles are the shallower sections of rivers where rocks often break the surface and slow down the flow of the water. 